and they have one in blue but i got it in pink because you know i'm a pink bitch feel me I'm back. I just came from Ulta and I got a couple things. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got. I look crazy. Let me fix my hair because this is a joke. Okay, that's a little better. This little hair right here is low on mine, but it's okay. So uh, I went to Ulta today. Okay, so I got a couple things that I wanted to show you guys. So I'm just going to go right into it. Lately, when I do my makeup, my powder um, doesn't really, like, come off as, well, doesn't come off as nice as it should. So, um, I pretty much brought a new powder brush, Real Techniques. Um, it is the powder for, um, it's the powder for bronzer and just regular powder, so... Um, I got that and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like it's pretty fluffy and I feel like when I swipe my powder off it'll be more seamless so I can just go like that because every time I swipe my powder off and I take a picture with the flash on it's like you can see splotchy spots of like my powder that's still like sitting on my face so um I got that and it's super soft like it feels so smooth so that's that and let me tell you guys something when you go to the beauty store any store that you guys go to make sure you steal the little oh, make sure you steal the little like you know spoolies sponges because these come in handy when you're traveling or you need to go out and you don't want to bring a whole brush set with you in your purse so you just put these in your purse and yeah like just don't don't leave without getting everything you came for like get your money's worth people anyways um then i got this contour from juvia's plates which i'm so excited to try because like like you guys seen in my last video i'm on the like quest to finding the perfect contour stick that i can use all the time i i do love my fenty still but i want to i want to try something new so i got this and i got in the color congo it's pretty dark but like your contour is supposed to be harsh so i figured get the darkest one um so hopefully it comes out good on my skin because i don't know i feel like i'm getting lighter because it's the winter but i'm definitely going to be darker once it starts getting nice outside so yeah i got um the contour stick and like i said it's in the color congo um i got another little thingy from juvia's place um it's their setting powder and it's the I Am Magic setting powder. Um, I got it in the color Co Gobi. Gobi. I think that's what it's called. And it's more warmer. Um, it's a warmer setting powder. Oh my god, my camera is always dying. Ah! So I got this setting powder by them. And, um... The color Gobi, and I want to show you guys how it looks because I'm, like I said, brown skin, dark skin. Well, I'm dark skin, not brown skin. Um, oh, I'm ripping the packaging. Hold on. Okay, perfect. Okay, so I got the contour stick, which I showed you guys, Congo, and then I got the setting powder from Juvia's Place, and um, I got this in the color Gobi. And I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. I don't know. I'm just kind of over my Too Faced um, setting powder. I feel like it makes me look a little too ashy. And here we go with my freaking face swollen up. So this is the Juvia's Place setting powder. And it's like a w way more warmer. It's a warmer brown. You guys can't really see it because of the camera lighting. Because you know my lighting on my camera is so walky. But, um, yeah, I'm kind of excited to try this because, but you know what I think? This is really small. Like, it's .445 ounces, and this is just, a, like, really small of studying powder to me. Like, they could have gave us more bang for our buck because this was, like, $16, so it better be good. 
and then I got a new beauty blender this is a morphe beauty blender and what I like about this it's angled more for highlight and contour so this stuff wants to open today huh so I got a morphe um, beauty blender and mm, I like how it's like you know so when I do my um, when I like you know carve my face for my contour it's like a nice slide that was that and then I got a lot of stuff um I got a, the Too Faced Born This Way Super Coverage Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer Ooh, that's a long title for a freaking product so I got this because my mother Jackie told me that this is supposed to be the shit so um i wanted to finally try it out i got in the color chai i had to go to another ulta to actually pick it up because they didn't have this color at the one that i went to so it must be a really popular color for like chocolate girls so um i got this in the color chai and i'm not gonna swatch it on my hand right now because i want to show you guys how it actually looks when i apply it on my face so that's gonna be for another video but yeah i got that and it's supposed to be hydrating and photo friendly long lasting you know all the good stuff i heard it's good so i'm giving it a try and then this is a lot no and then i brought this from maybelline hopefully this is my color because this looks a little gray to me but anyway i bought this it's a full coverage powder foundation super stay it's in the color java i didn't buy this for my face i actually bought this for my hair because um the girl who does my hair <laughs> she's moving to Atlanta so your girl's gonna have to learn how to do her hair by herself because I have no other option and the other only other way I'm gonna get my hair slayed is if I go down to the city and so I will be getting my hair done on special occasions only now um yeah so i'm gonna start learning how to do my hair and i know that a lot of the time people who do hair they put this inside of the cap to make it blend with their scalp i just hope that this blends with my scalp like it's supposed to blend with your scalp or your skin i don't know but we're gonna give it a try i don't know just something about it looks kind of gray to me now that i see it under the light maybe i'm bugging but it just looks gray to me i'm not gonna open it right now we'll set that for another time and then I bought this from Ulta Beauty. It's the Radiant Rose Lip Oil infused with chamomile oil. This stuff makes your lips so pink and so gives you like that nice natural pigment of pink. Like I just love it. So um, I had got this um, and yeah it has avocado oil in it which is supposed to soothe your lips. I have some now. Well I had some on earlier my lips look pretty good so that's what i got from ulta then i went to marshall's because you know if i go to ulta i gotta go to marshall's and i gotta go to target i didn't get nothing from target but i got a couple things from marshall's i had seen um one of my favorite youtubers christina Villegas. She, her mom had got her these and i wanted to try them out and like maybe put one in my purse just for like emergencies but it's like a waterless shaver so basically you don't need any water you don't need a sink you don't need a shower you can literally shave on the go and i think this is so freaking popping like why didn't they have these when i was in high school when i had to literally shave my legs in the school bathroom before i went to a basketball game like I, I don't get why they didn't have these years ago like this is incredible so it's basically like a pocket shaver you just pull it out like you can just shave anywhere shave on the go you don't need no water I don't know if there's water inside of this or what but it kind of looks like there's something like um I don't know it looks like there's something in here I don't know but we're gonna give it a try and I'll give you guys some feedback on how I actually like it but um yeah i bought a waterless shaver from marshall's and they were only three dollars yeah. this is why you can't go wrong with marshall like you just can't you can never go wrong with marshall i got this hopefully this fits my big ass head but this is basically for when you are doing your makeup when you're taking a shower and you don't want your edges wet you don't want your 
you don't want shit in the way pretty much then this is perfect for me because every time i'm doing my face mask my weave or my freaking hair something just always gets in the way so literally i bought this so when i do my makeup too like nothing's in the way or nothing gets on my frontal and yeah this is like you know a little cute a little cute 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 and they have one in blue but i got it in pink because you know i'm a pink bitch me but yeah guys so that's pretty much it that's what i got on my little adventure today um today was a lot shorter because i didn't have to get a new phone today like last time but yeah um this video is gonna be a little short because i just wanted to show you guys what i got um let me know in the comments what you guys want me to try out and record because obviously i'm not gonna try out everything and then record it but i definitely want to show you guys how the setting powder um turns out and how the brush actually turns out too because i'm that was really the main thing that i was looking forward to today was trying to get a new brush because my makeup has been so wacky guys like so bad like it just looks so bad because I'm not taking all the setting powder off my face. So when I have the flash on, it literally looks like blotches. Like, it's just so bad. But I will see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you subscribe because you ain't getting free content over here, boo. I need to see some results. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.